Hey guys, Tarkin Cyclone FPV, and as I'm closing up this flywheel right here, um, I, just, I just realized, hey, maybe I'll go ahead and do a video on how to set up the VTX table for this, okay? So let's go ahead and knock, knock that out real quick. First thing is we're running a JHE MCU Mini 5848. To show you which one that is, that's actually gonna be right here on our website. You go to cyclonefpv.com, and then you go to the, uh, oops, you go to the uh, FPV gear, and then you go down to VTX, and then you go down to JHE MCU, you're gonna see the one I'm working on right now is this one right here. And I just added a link for this so that you could go to video tutorials and instructions. And you'll see that here's the file that you're gonna need. I also mentioned here that you could not just left click on it. Here's what's gonna happen. It's gonna open the file. Can't do that. What you wanna do is you wanna right click on it and left click on save link as, okay? And then it's gonna open and save it as your JSON file, okay? So make sure to do that. And then the video that I'm making right now about this will actually uh, be posted right under there so you can watch it. All right, so here's what we're gonna do. First thing we're gonna do is let's go ahead and once it's wired up, let's go ahead and plug in uh, our, our um, USB and we're gonna switch over to Betaflight, okay? So let me show you that, here we go. All right, once we switch over to Betaflight and connect uh, and you go to your, uh, the first thing on here is obviously on your ports, you're gonna wanna have your smart audio set for IRC Tramp and not for TBS, okay? wherever, whichever you are that is gonna be. In this case, it's a soft serial. Whoever yours is gonna be, make sure you set it for IRC trap and not TBS, okay? Then you're gonna go down to video transmitter. And what's gonna happen here is you need to load the file that you just downloaded. So basically you're gonna click load from file and then you would have downloaded the file gave you, which is this one right here, you click open. And then it's gonna import all the settings because yours is gonna be blank until you do this, okay? And there it is all right there. Then you click save, that's it. So that's how you load your VTX table. So go in there, your table will be empty. There should be nothing in here. It's gonna be blank waiting for you to do that. And all you do is just load that file um, that, uh, that you download from that link there, and then uh, load the file and then click save, and your VTX table is done, and then everything else is ready to go, all right? If you have any questions on that, guys, you can always hit me up at cyclonefpv.com. Uh, most importantly, please, please subscribe to our channel below. Uh, I like to show my kids that we actually have people paying attention that are helping to boost our numbers here. And for some reason, young people think it's cool to have a bunch of followers. I have no idea. Uh, our subscribers, subscribers. Um, outside of that, guys, God bless. Be safe. Most of all, go spend time with your family. You never know how much time you have left, guys. So go make the most of it. And I will be back with another video shortly and some pretty cool new drone stuff that we're doing. See ya. Peace.